head crew coach, Dave O'Neill. Dave, what did you see from each boat today? Uh, well, in terms of the uh, the three NCA boats, um, you know, the, the four was a different lineup. We've been uh, changing lineups around with that. And they got down to Stanford in the first half, and I give them a lot of credit for staying with them and you know, fighting all, all the way down the course. But uh, And we knew that that Stanford four and that second eight were going to be quite good. And, uh, you know, we just got beat by better crews today. And, uh, and I, we've identified, you know, we have so many good kids in for, the, for, for our first eight and second eight and our four, and I think we've identified across the board, like, what we need to do better. And uh, a lot of credit to Stanford across the board today. They uh, clearly motivated, clearly rowing well, uh, clearly faster than us on the way down the course, so uh, kudos to them. And uh, for the second eight, uh, we changed, uh, made a big change in a wholly different lineup. Uh, and today was actually the first race, the first uh, piece. I think it was a good starting point, but um, you know, again, they got down. It sounded like they started to move on Stanford, and Stanford held them off. So uh, yeah, came up short on that end. And then on the first date, they were down, maybe even open water at the thousand meter mark, and uh, clawed back in, but still lost by a full length. And uh, yeah, Stanford definitely uh, brought everything they could today. So uh, and that's what that's what this race is all about, you know. So uh, kudos to them again, like I said. And uh, yeah, we need to do better. So what did you learn from today that you'll take moving into Pac-12 championship? You know, uh, I guess the big thing you can't take anything for granted. I think we have a good team, uh, and there's a lot of good individuals and people rowing well. And, but you know, anybody can beat anybody on any day. And uh, and we knew that Stanford was fully motivated and they were going to give everything they had. And um, you know, we just need to bring out, you know, we need to bring out the best in us. So uh, you know, I think we can do it, but it's going to be tough. And finally, what was the significance of racing as Team Jill today? Yeah, Team Jill, that that means a lot, you know. And uh, Kara Kohler, she mentioned yesterday afternoon that she's uh, the last teammate on our team, the last woman on our team that was teammates with Jill, and uh, to let that sink in, and uh, you know, but Jill. And I mentioned uh, to the team this week, yeah, we're racing his team, Jill, and some of the guys said, hopefully you guys know the story of Jill, and some of our team's like, yeah, if you, haven't, if you don't know, you haven't been paying attention. I'm like, okay, so Jill, um, you know, in terms of making the most of every day and keeping things in perspective, you know, and seeing the positives and things, and, uh, you know, certainly when a uh, day like today, when it was a pretty tough day for us, and, uh, you know, I think uh, knowing Jill and having the Jill influence is going to help us keep things in perspective and keep moving forward. Great. Thanks, Coach. Go Bears. Go Bears.